Hi everyone, welcome again at another vlog. This time it's still in Spain, but getting closer to Valencia. I remember that we saw a beach in the last episode. It was pretty windy there and there was the b-roll shot of the beach in the vlog. And yesterday I saw Indiana Jones. There's the same beach as it was. So I visited the beach where one of the scenes from Indiana Jones Last Crusade, if I remember the name correctly, is shot. It's the scene uh, where his father makes the seagulls fly above in the sky and they manage to destroy the plane or manage to disable the flight capabilities of the plane so it crashes. I suddenly remembered my Charlemagne. Let my armies be the rocks and the trees and the birds in the sky. Okay, let's go back to the journey. It was just a quick note that I wanted to share with you. Roll the intro. No, not still not working. Okay. Parked the night before on nicely leveled parking. It was right around, I don't know, sunset. The village was pretty small, so the, the walk around took like 20 30 minutes. And then the usual dinner, getting drunk, bed, sunrise, simple life. What more you want to do i think it was kind of nice although a little bit windy but the sunrise definitely worth it and the sunset between the hills on the other side definitely worth it too in the morning breakfast as usual but it was a little bit windy so there is not much drone shots that i wanted to took because the drone which stood in a place was actually flying out away directly to the sea and that's really not a pleasant view you want to <laughs> if you want to look for a drone in the sea so i managed to take one picture one shot which you saw in the intro it's like the rocket shot up above i didn't know what the goal was today but managed to find uh, little distractions along the way like salt lakes especially the pink lake Murcia and arrived to Valencia. I'm whispering because actually, according to the sign, you shouldn't be speaking loudly because of the birds. We arrived at the observatory after, uh, let's say, 220 kilometers. You're supposed to see flamingos here, but I'm not sure we will be that lucky today. I want to check the cow tower and we wanted to actually swim here, but it's prohibited, so the sea is that way. That's actually the plan for today, just to rest and then find a place to sleep.
cave he decided to visit Pink Lake and it looks pretty nasty. What the fuck? And it's actually pink. Right? It looks pink. And it looks pretty disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, this disgusting part behind us. <laughs> mm. <laughs> okay. It's really salty. Get all the salt. Actually, it's pretty disgusting right now. Oh, fuck no. Did I? Yeah, I did. I did step inside it. I did, I stepped in it. <laughs> but I think this was worth it. Actually, it doesn't look that bad. Yeah, it's bad, I can feel it. That was really magnificent, although a little bit gross, but <laughs> whatever. It was fun. And in the end, found out a place next to the beach. Pretty leveled, not that crowded. Stayed there to the next day. I went swimming. Obviously, when you park somewhere, there is this exploration time when you go around and take pictures of basically almost everything because you want to have the memories. Maybe, maybe I should roll the video more, but yeah, next time I'll be more smarter to actually plan the shots, make the idea behind it so it's more pleasant to view. There's like a depth behind it. I was mostly enjoying it more than just rolling it and watching through the viewfinder. So I would like to wrap it up here. I hope you see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.